Rest in peace to Billy Legron, y'all. His friends and family don't play in Cleveland. Uh, unfortunately, he was unalived by Jerome. And a few hours later, when they saw Jerome at the liquor store, oh, baby, they beat him down and held him until the police came. The police had to come and save him. Y'all, people tired of y'all messing with their loved ones. So, again, rest in peace to Billy and good looking out to his family. I tell you, that's what people do. More than a dozen people taking matters into their own hands. Back up, back up, back up. Back up. Hey. Surrounding a murder suspect outside a convenience store just before 11 o'clock back on June 5th. We now know this is Jerome Lee. About three hours earlier, Cleveland police say he killed Billy Legron near West 39th in Denison. This is body cam footage of police arriving there. 18 seconds ago. Come on, man, stay with me. Hey, come on, come on, man, okay. wake up. It wasn't until later that they heard about the mob just down the street. Based on what the group was screaming, these are friends and family members of the victim. Cops trying to keep them calm as they sort things out. Eventually, they decide Lee, the suspected shooter, isn't too hurt to be taken in. Get off right now. They literally form a human shield to bust through the crowd. They're still shouting at the guy and police. They get through the parking lot slowly but surely and to a waiting squad car. Jerome Lee was officially arrested later that night and booked in the county jail. He's since been indicted for the murder of Billy Legrone.